Um, so Comic Con. Comic Con is 150,000 people descending on San Diego, and I'm going to be in the middle of it. Um, com the people at Comic Con, San Diego Comic Con, have been kind enough to give us a, um, a panel. We're going to be having a panel. It's going to be actors who we have in the show. It's going to be the producers, the directors, the writers. Uh, it's going to be me, of course. It's going to be. In fact, there's even going to be an executive from Kickstarter on the panel with us, talking about Kickstarter. It's going to be, she's flying in from New York, and uh, it's going to be great. And we'll be able to meet, meet our fans and, and talk to them. We're going to also show some footage that we've never shown before. We're going to unveil some exclusive footage at, at Comic-Con. And then the next day, we're going to be doing a signing, where we're going to have an exclusive poster that we're going to be signing to a whole bunch of people. And... Uh, and we're gonna, you know, be wearing our Space Command T-shirts and <laughs> and going to town. And we're gonna have a party where we're gonna have, um, uh, you know, with the countdown because we our our Space Command uh, Kickstarter campaign ends Saturday night, you know, midnight New York time, 9 p.m. our time. So we're gonna have a countdown. We're gonna have all of our friends there and all of our fans who want to come. And we're gonna be in a big room and we're gonna be cheering and shouting and, you know, looking to see how high that number gets. Um, you know. Tell, tell your friends, tell your family, tell your grandma, you know, and uh, it's going to be great. What's the exact date? The date is, the, the panel is July 13th, Friday, July 13th, uh, room 5A and B, it's 8.30 to 9.30 p.m., and our campaign ends the next day, uh, Saturday, July, 19, uh, July 14th, Saturday, July 14th, uh, 9 p.m. Pacific Time, uh, midnight, Eastern Time, and uh, it's going to be great. And did you schedule, I mean, did you plan your campaign around Comic-Con? Yes. Did you know that was yes. going to be part of... We, we, we started our campaign on Coast to Coast, which is this radio show that I go on every few months, and it has a huge listenership, five million people. George Murray. Right, George Murray. And, he, and we've actually cast him in Space Command. He's going to play a character, which is there. He told me that, that someone said he would be reincarnated as a talk show host named Dexter Monterey, so we've actually put that character in Space Command. <laughs> so it's going to be great fun. And... Uh, so we started with that, and then we're ending with Comic Con. So the idea was that to anchor the campaign at the beginning of the at the end. So um, because again, it's you know what what's going to get attention, what's going to get noticed, what's going to bang the drum. Because I feel enormously confident. Look, I'm if I weren't doing Space Command, I would be thrilled to be watching Space Command. It would be something. I mean, you know, I was first in line to see Prometheus. I'm I'm this, I know what I am, and I know there's millions of people like me, and so. Uh, you know, so uh, so I'm thrilled to be creating something that's exciting to me and to millions of people, and uh, you know, and then it's just an obligation of doing it because the challenge is doing it for a low number. You know, a hundred thousand dollars sounds like a lot of money to any anyone, but to make a movie, uh, let alone a series of films, it's it's a challenge. And if I didn't have the friends I have, who are geniuses at special effects, geniuses at production, genius actors, you know, it's because of the people I know that makes me confident I can do this. Uh, you know, if I was just starting out, I would never attempt something like this. It would be impossible to deliver something with this amount of effects and this amount of this scope uh, on this budget. No, but I know I can do it because I know what I've done and I know who, who, who my friends are. So it's cool. It seems like you've been almost waiting your whole life for this project. Mm. I have. I have. I mean, everything I've done, all the hundreds of hours of television, all the books, all the everything, all the people I've met. Um, you know, it's very gratifying to me that that. that that Damon Lindelof and Guillermo and all of these dear friends and, and you know showrunners uh, and and A-list people are, are are in favor of what I'm doing and backing what I'm doing. Brandon Braga just said that he wants to do donate to our campaign. Brandon comes off Star Trek and 24 and uh, uh, you know uh, Terra Nova. You know these are these are friends, and, but it's very nice to see their faith in me because they have confidence that I can pull this off. And and frankly, I do too. You know, it's it's that that's the other part of it. Um, I'm, I wouldn't undertake this if I didn't didn't know if I could do it and do it wonderfully. And so I'm chomping at the bit. I can't wait. And we're and, and I'm actually we're not waiting. I'm I've, I'm writing the scripts and 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 we're building sets and building spacesuits and you know um, Ian McKay who designed Darth Maul and Queen Amidala is aboard and he's designing aliens and characters and so we're not. We're, then there was never a question whether we we would do this or not. The only thing that I didn't know is if we could raise the money on Kickstarter. But I was determined to make this regardless. You know, if it was a matter of you know. Doing it on, you know, getting a job at a restaurant and taking tips and, you know, <laughs> making it off tips, you know, whatever, <laughs> whatever works, you know. And uh, we were going to make this no matter what. And, and I'm so grateful to everyone who's helping us make it.